hello students welcome back to english language class and today in my class i am going to teach you the lesson phrasal verb which will be appearing in your question 3b which will carry 5 marks so let me explain what is phrasal verb phrasal verb is a combinations of verb and prepositions or adverbial particles it's called phrasal verb it assumes a new meaning from the initial meaning of the verb the functions of the phrasal verb is to make the language flexible and beautiful so here this will help you to means understand the language in a flexible tone all right and it will help you to uh, fill up the that suitable words which will be appearing in your questions okay so one by one i'll explain you the list of phrasal verb like there is no other way no simple formula to end up this uh, exercise you have to understand the meaning of the word which will be means coming at the end of the verb okay so you have to memorize those term understanding the meaning okay so there are plenty of phrasal verb i am going to list out only few uh, words here today so for, for example the first word i want to talk about that is act starting with a so act uh, in this word what kind of uh, the preposition you will use here act on now what does the word act on meaning you have to understand the meaning of act on act on means here act according to or to produce an effect that is called act on for example she has acted on my advice now the verb came first then preposition no so this is the act on is actually a phrasal verb so you are going to use in the dashes next one a uh, next example i am showing you like giving you the med the medicines will act on the patients after some time that means here act on means what produce an effect the second one is telling produce an effect and first one is telling act according to okay the next one now backup backup meaning to support okay now how will use the word backup in a sentence i backed him up during the elections now your backed up means what supported okay somebody supported in the elections that is called backup next one starting with b again back off o w f off now back off means to retreat okay example seeing the intense anger she backed off means uh, retreating means what like means not accompanying you that is called retreating understood next starting with b next word that is bear away bear away means to win like if you use in the sentence with the example anil bore away the first prize in sports now here bore away means i use the past form of the verb that means bear becomes bore all right so here bore away means to win the first prize that means anil has won the first prize in the sports year okay next word bear with bear with means to be patience okay here he had to bear with her rude behavior that means means you need to have a patience to understand okay to um, his behavior that is uh, shown in the sentence next one again starting with b the word is break now with the word break what are the preposition all right you are going to use so break uh down so we are going to use the word break down now what does the word break down meaning break down means stop working because of fault it's called break down okay example our car broke down on the highway now again i have used the past form of the verb here that is break becomes broke so now you are broke down meaning to stop working that means the car has stop working understood like if you use such words no i uh, like writing your article writing report writing as well as uh, composition writing it will, it will it will give a good impression to the reader all right so you try to use this uh, language skill writing in your uh, compositions uh, report etc next word that i am going to talk about that is bear with sorry 
not bear with break up break up means to end okay to bring to an end it's called break up so example the meeting broke up late night that means here broken means what the meeting ended late night understood so this way you complete the word with uh, break up next one bring okay starting with the bring the verb is bring now what preposition that you are going to use with the verb bring so here with the example i have shown you bring out okay bring out means to produce reveal publish so there are three meanings with the bring out produce reveal and publish so first example with the uh, produce like the juggler brought out a big ball that means here again i have used the past form of the word bring that is brought that means brought out means to produce that means juggler produced a big ball all right second one reveal an artist brings out the characteristics of nation okay so here brings out in the second sentence means what reveal next one in the third sentence is a publish now the publisher has brought out a new edition of his dictionary that means here brought out means here that means publisher has produced okay published next one next word is again bring now with the bring the preposition that i have used here bring up now what does the word bring up mean bring up means rear okay he was brought up by his grandparents that means brought up means looked after all right so the children is looked after by parents that means you will use the word bring up you cannot change such words it comes with the list all right you there is no other way you will have to memorize such phrasal verb terms which is given in your total english you will read one by one all the phrasal terms that is given in your total english book so now i am going to show you one example with the exercise all right let's move on so now here you have a fresh questions uh, of the chapter which i have just explained that is phrasal verb but the question will appear like this in your paper that is question 3b it will be written fill in the blanks with suitable words now you don't get confused by looking at the suitable words suitable words here means talks about the phrasal verb chapter that i have explained and it will carry 5 marks in your examinations so here is the questions please follow properly question 1 says our shop bring a large sum of money now here you could see here again bring brings that means which are the appropriate phrasal verb which will come with the word brings here brings in that means it has brought a large sum of money by the shop all right next one a good tree brings good fruit that means again the next verb is here that is brings so here the which phrasal verb will come in appropriate way here that is brings out brings out good fruit okay next one you see here his small income brought his standard of living that means because of income all right there is a uh, because of income his standard of living has changed so here the word preposition will come here brings in his standard of living next sentence anita was brought by her aunt like this sentence this kind of sentence just now i have explained here brought up looked after that means brought up by her aunt all right next sentence you have here improve sorry impure water brings diseases that means what diseases uh, that means because of water what happens it uh, the appropriate preposition will come here brings forth that means because of impure, impure water disease has spread okay next one the praise has brought a new editions of the book that means this kind of also i have explained means this kind of uh, that means it is publishing publishing that means brought out brought out a new editions 
of the book. Next sentence you have number seven. They brought us to their views. Now here, brought us. That means uh, means came in a like views. What the speaker is saying here. So the appropriate phrasal verb with the preposition will be brought us round. Next one, the government has brought many changes in the taxation. Now, what the government has done, okay, in the uh, taxation. So, the word that will appear with the brought will be brought about. Rahul backed his commitment. Again, backed. This also I have explained the, the word backed from commitment. That means backed out. Backed out means to leave. Understood? From his commitment. Next one. The meeting broke late night. That means end up. This also I have explained just now. That is end up. That means the preposition will come here. Broke up. Understood? So, this way you can complete the exercise question like this in your, which will appear in your paper and you will be able to gather 5 marks as a whole. Thank you so much for this class. Stay home, stay safe.